What do you think of your new home? Let me go now, please. No can do. Or a siphon. Oh, oh, oh. All right. All right. Quit moaning. Oh, oh, God. Let's keep this between us. Oh, you saved my life. I owe you. Not that right. I do. Oh. Oh. Now, I, I gotta get out of here. Don't much like it around here no more. Glad I could help. Keep your eyes on the ground, huh? Mr. Morgan, I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your God has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. <laughs> no more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us forced liquor down his throat. Friend, I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither. But seeing, I do just fine. You want to step outside or do a business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They are children of God. How's about you playing this place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? Sure. I'll play a few hands. Well, sit yourself down then. I'm Luther. This is Marvin. Fortunate for you both for being gentlemen about this. Same goes for you. So, how you two know each other anyway? Don't seem like the likeliest of friends, if you don't mind me saying. We go a long way back. And now you're his chaperone? I guess it's something like that. Can we play? Huh. He can't be no real clergyman. <laughs> He committed about five cardinal sins just in that chair you're sitting in. I think he used to be. 
He's drifted a little in recent years. Yeah, life is a challenge to all of us. Yeah, I'll uh, check. Can you imagine him at the pulpit? If he could stand up. On the fourth day, he turned water into whiskey, and I don't remember much after that. <laughs> <laughs> He's a decent fella going through a bad time. Disrespect him again, and you'll find yourself in a bad time, too. All right, all right. Just trying to have a little fun here. It is a game, after all, mister. Not for me. I'll check. Okay. Here, look. Pile of crap. Don't laugh. <laughs> Hellfire. Ah. Okay, yes. Gentlemen, this is getting too rich for me. Well, sit down. Oh, I'm done, friend. It's been a real education. Come on, Rip. Where is he? Where'd he go? Who? The Reverend. Where is... <sighs> Excuse me, gentlemen. Reverend! Reverend Swanson! Where'd you go? Excuse me, I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, a priest, wandering about? Sure, we saw him, <laughs> smelt him, and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Guy looked kind of crazy, mister. Well, you have no idea. <laughs> Get your hands off him now, you son of a bitch. What the hell is your problem? He's with me. Okay, please, don't hurt me. You tell anyone what you saw back there? You're a dead man. You understand me? Skip, I, I won't tell a soul. I promise. This never happened. Okay there?
still be saved? What have you done with your foot? It appears to like this place and wants to stay. Get your foot out of here! Twist your leg, you drunken bastard! Get it! Come on! You. What the hell is wrong with you? Throwing me off a bridge like there that? There was a goddamn train, you crazy bastard! <sighs> Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry. Uh, I wish I was different. <laughs> Let's get you home. Home? Yeah, that's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? But... Let's go, boy. he'd show up. You better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. Oh, what happened? Just the usual. Poor oh. bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky. This time. Real lucky. Probably just needs to sleep it off. Mr. Strauss. Hey, I'm Morgan. Hey, Arthur. Jose? You want to go hunting? <laughs> what are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No, I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God. But you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Well, where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. 
This one's okay, but ain't no boat to see. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now, unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. If there's a decent dealer there, we'll unload him and you can buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on him. Let's get going. Okay. Well, I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. And the stables always have the best ones. Well, I guess you're right. This is going to be fun, Arthur. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel. If I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. Okay, see if you can get your leg over that brute. Come on, he's not that bad. All the time. Easy, big feller. All right, let's head into town. We're heading now. Might be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. How you... have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, uh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy. Threatened to kill the whole town. And Davy was passed out so cold we left him there. Came back in the next day and he woke up and started right back drinking again. <laughs> those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spot, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. <laughs> Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Tables are just up ahead. All right, go sell that big brute. And buy yourself a horse. Okay. I'm going off to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out. <laughs> Meet you back here in a bit. Hey, how can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. <whistles> yeah. Well, what about this one here? Yeah, are you looking to sell? I show you. You got papers? No. No papers. Uh, of course, that's going to affect what I can pay. But your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable them here for you. Here, take a look.
partner. You got yourself a deal. And a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. And you have my word on that. Here are your papers. And on me, a new grooming brush. And some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you. You treat this fella well. I know he's gonna look after you just fine. Looks like a nice animal you got there. You happy? Guess we'll see. Easy. Yeah, that's your Are boy. you gonna mount that new horse of yours or not? You won't know till you get in the saddle. All right, let's get going. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. So, what's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run, up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains? I sure didn't figure uh, on that. But this time, we're doing the chasing. So how are things with you and John? Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for a goddamn year. I've spoken Order. to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's Cole. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. <sighs> Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. Okay, I think we need to head right up here. Yes, I remember this place, Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. I'll try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. Just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I have hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes. And obliterated them with a shotgun, if I remember right. your way.
getting late. Reckon we should camp here. Sure. Well, then you get a set up. Uh, I've famished. Cook that rabbit, then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. You want some of this? No, I'm fine. I don't like eating this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. <sighs> all right. Well, we better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. He better be worth all this drama. <coughs> Morning, Arthur. <coughs> you ready? Well, oh, give me a minute. Coffee? Sure. There you go. So, what's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track him, but we might need to lay bait to draw him out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas bait, then shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous. But we'll have a much better chance of getting a good shot in. And... If he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish packing this up? Fish, berries. I'll tie it up in that rag when you're done. I hope you know what you're talking about. I grew up in the mountains, Arthur. I was... Actually weaned on bear meat. How you getting on with that bait? Okay. I think I got this done. Hey, you son Good. of a bitch. Pack up and we'll get going. Come on, grab your stuff. Let's go. Okay, let's go. Okay, boy. We'll try our luck down by the water. That's where I saw him last. Okay. How's that horse treating you? So far, so good. You know, I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the light? Uh, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess you were still young. Didn't last long. I drifted back into it. She understood. She knew what I was. Yeah, I remember you not being around for a while, but oh, things were looser back then. Truth is, there's never really any getting out. And staying in, it's hard. You know that. But Bessie and I made it work. Why? You thinking about getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen, if Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, maybe we can all have a new start. Anyway, for now, let's try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? Let's look by the water here, see if he's been fishing again recently. Look for tracks, dung, bones, any sign of him.
Josh here, Jose. He sure looked big enough. Good. Let's hope it's him. Can you tell which way he went? This way. The tracks go into those trees. eaten fish here must have been left by our friend i reckon come on see if there's anything else something else on the ground just here there's shit here watch your step looks real fresh reckon he's got to be close let's keep going like the trail ends here. We lost him? For now. Uh, a little optimism, Arthur. <sighs> well, what do you think? I think we split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work? Which do you think? Let's bait here. Fine by me. Let's leave the bag over there. By those boulders up ahead, looks like a good spot for it. You say? More or less. Big scar down his face. Hey, did that bait look okay to you? I think so. You're the expert. Ready with your gun there? I'm good. You okay? I see nerve. So see you. I'm fine. Let's just take a look at that bait. Sure. Come on. We only just said it, Jose. I know, but we need to do this right. What do you have here? Got your knife? Shit. Take it easy. You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. It's nothing. Ugh. Nothing at all. <laughs> Thank you. I think. <laughs> that was fun. 
You know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> he said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Thank you. It's a pleasure. You saved my life, Arthur. <laughs> I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> You coming, or you gonna track that monster? Well, you coming or not? Well, I'm gonna stick <laughs> around here for a while. <laughs> uh, I'll see you back at camp. Yeah. Getting close.
space there. All right, let's have a look. Boy, the things I can make with this. <laughs> <laughs> 